Purposes only, and here initially we are giving sciatic block, and the approach is the thotomy position where the hip has been flexed and knee has been flexed both at 90 degrees. And uh, this is the greater trochanter. This is the greater trochanter. I have felt the greater trochanter, mark the outer border. This is the ischial tuberosity, the lowermost dependent part that has been marked, and I can feel this groove. This group extends upwards and this is the tract along with sciatic nerve lens. So it is basically a sort of subgluteal or gluteal approach to the sciatic in lithotomy position. Okay. We have taken a 10 centimeter long stimulus needle and uh, peripheral nerve stimulator. Please set it at 1.5. Okay. And the just a point of entry has been marked. Okay. And what we do is just go perpendicular to the skin and try to elicit the response which can be a plantar or a dark common peroneal response. Let's see. This is the gluteal response. This is no, this is hamstring response. You can appreciate the hamstrings are contracting. This is not a absolute response because many a times fibers have already differentiated who supply the hamstrings. We should target this response. See, just it has started. Let me go a little deep and we are getting this plantar response. Okay. Plantar flexion response. We are, we are in the right proper plane. Please reduce the current from 1.6. Keep reducing, keep reducing, keep reducing. So we are at 0.8, and still we can see plantar response. See, it is still there. Gentle manipulation to see if we can refine it further. You can appreciate it. You can appreciate the plantar response. Come closer, further. Appreciating it. Show it. This is at 0.6. Reduce the current further at 0.48. Still appreciated? No. Let's see. Still appreciated. Okay. So at 0.48, we can appreciate it. We can reduce it further to see whether we have not entered intraneurally. Reduce it to 0.20. It is visible. 0.20. It is not visible. So, no response at 0 0.20, come back to 0 0.48, okay, again the response is there. Now let's see what happens on injecting the drug, just 1 ml of local anesthesia at 0 0.48 milliamperes and the response is disappeared. This is because, uh, uh, this is called positive rasters, so we'll inject the whole drug here. The advantage of lithotomy is patient will not have to be turned. So if the patient is in pain or for some reason you cannot convert the patient into lateral position or a prone position, this may be used. Okay? So this is one of the uh, approaches which we can use for giving a trans uh, uh, subgluteal sciatic nerve block. Okay? Start.